I tell you this is going to be the first time to start taking the back plate off and timing and putting it all back together. I think my corner cord is just a bit too long. So let's wrap it around, see if it will start. And let's chug it on, let's wind it right up. Get the in compression, let's go. No, nothing there yet. Didn't think so. Compression. Still nothing yet. Sometimes you get this, it won't start the first time. I think, I wonder why, chug it on and throttle it on as well. And I think, uh, maybe put a little bit of spray down there to get it working now. It's got a spark on it anyway. Take it off. Put a bit of light this on. <coughs> oh dear, that stuff is swollen. Put a little bit of engine stock on the spot plug. Let's see if it will follow up. That's fine. That's all I can. Doing this thing. Hmm. That's not looking good, is it? That's just dirty button there, yeah, and it hasn't. Okay, if we got a spark on it. It's a white spot, it's not good. The white spot should just start this now. I haven't done it yet. Let's get my little shorter, bit of long. Bit long. Bit 
Well, it's just a long, but I'm not going to one. And there's petrol going through the carburetor. Right, there's petrol in the carburetor now. I've done a tick off on it, make it last. Get it? Get the um, compression on it. What? Hey, what's happening here? Uh, this started for ages. That should have went. Let's start doing it. Uh-huh, I can see where the trouble is. It's, it's threading the carburetor. That's what I've done. I've got a problem with the um, uh, carburetor. Uh, yeah. Uh, yeah. Uh, all right. That's where the trouble is. It's the, uh, actually the float in the, uh, what's causing the trouble. It's, um, tap it. It's flooding. Let's try it again. Now. See again. See what it does to the No, even when it starts first time, it's that you find that yourself. Once it's running and up, then it'll be alright again. It's just at least running in. It's not even trying. It's so clean, we've got a spark. It's still not far enough. Is there any compression in the engine? If this won't do it, there's something wrong. Sometimes it could be the spark that can cause this. The spark that dies will be better. Nah, that should have started with that stuff on the end.
Is it flooded? Hmm. Well, it's on the spot. So you cannot do that. It's just getting out there. So it won't fire up. So when are we in? That's why it's not falling up. What's up here? There's the problem. What's on it? The reason it won't fire up is the photo. What's up here? There's no photo linkage. Right. I found the problem. Why it won't fire up? I thought all linkage ain't working. Yeah, why isn't it working? Don't care I'll take the can off again. If I can might have to. See why this thing cool. Let's see them. What's going on? Hmm. Yeah, take this thing off again. Uh oh. I've got pets for weekend as well. Got a lot of things in there. <sighs> Shall we see what we This is here. Really, it's not working. Well, it's jammed up. So we have to take this off for the bit. See what's going on again. So you don't put any bed up, and you start it, it won't start. So, I'm doing these again now. What a pain. If you try anything, you're right, you won't start with some engine. What do you like? It's now working. Good job I didn't take the car off again. Let's have me just have a slightly shift on it. careful when you do that as well, they can strip. Easy, isn't it? That's about it for that one. Do the second one here. Oh, 
Right, that's done. Put the um, this back on. Tap on the photo is now working. Correct.